Oh, hello there. Just been looking at my new USB socket testers, look at voltage, all those sorts of things. Really quite interesting. Anyway, welcome to the Flying Doctor's Top Tech Tips. If you've been here before, then welcome back. Great to see you again. If it's your first time, enjoy what you see here. Look around everything else we've got. And like it, subscribe to it, tell other people about it, share the joy. And if there's any particular subjects that you want me to look out for you, then put those in the comments of the video and I'll see what I can do. Anyway, today we're going to be looking at how we can search with in files for particular words, combinations, words, those sorts of things, rather than just relying on file names and folders. Really exciting subject, so let's dive in. Okay, we're opening the new search window. And you see, there's a couple of modes. There's expert mode and basic mode. We're going to start in basic mode, although export mode does give you more options as you see more filters come up. So into basic mode, and we're going to be looking for a PDF file. So we type in the file name, looking for a PDF file, and we're trying to find something where we put the word daily in. File name was or where it was. And we're going to select the fact it's in the Banbury directory, I'm Treasurer of Banbury Gliding Club. Now we'll start the search. It's running along. You can found something already. You can see over there how much is found, how, how far it's looking into the megabytes. Searching files, and now it's found the result of what we're looking for. And I go, oh yeah, of course that's what it was, that's what it was called. Great. It's trying to get along. See if we can find any more. I think I'll probably truncate this part of the video. Here comes some more. This is going to some pretty vast files, those are. It's doing really, really quite well. Finding lots and lots more. Super. So you can go down and see where it's found them in each of the individual files. You can see a summary of what's happened. You can click the details of where the problems were as far as there and you can get a report that you can print out if you want too late. Now we're going to look for daily and another term and progress. Okay press start it's going to look through PDF files for anything that has the word. It can take a while but there you go found some more well, not quite as many as last time but you can see it's looking for progress and daily there you go. So now let's have a look at uh, advanced mode, expert mode rather, which is more advanced. So you can see it's got more options. Look for a bigger than a certain size, smaller than a certain size. This way, so there's another filter there. You can look for it, things that are modified after a certain date or before a certain date. You can be case sensitive. So you're looking for match exactly the case of the terms you're putting in. And you decide whether to look for subfolders or not. By clicking that on or off. Okay. In this tab, you can see there's various various abilities to look for things. And in the dates you can say modified, created, last access. So you can be much more specific about things. Really much more in a, a expert mode than there is in basic mode. So let's look for an open an open document spreadsheet, which has the, the word financials in it. And again, we'll look for a folder. In this case, we're going back into Banbury. Okay. So you can see you can search a wide range of types of file, not just TXT files, you can do Word documents, um, documents, PDFs, Excel, in this case, Excel spreadsheets, all sorts of things. And you can see it's found it there. And you can see the result is found, and we see this is financial in that spreadsheet. So now we'll do a Boolean search. We're going to look at an open document text, which is a bit like a Word document, really. And we're looking for ones that contain the word Google, but not the word Android. And we're going to have a look in the Flying Doctor. And subfolders as well. So let's start this off at Trundles. 
a lot of files is going through, so it's going to go well, but it's discovered he's got nothing there that mentions Google and not Android. So, success in the fact that we know there isn't anything there, so that's pretty good. Now let's change that to and Android, so it's Google and Android. And wow, look at all the stuff it's finding where it mentions Google and Android at the same time. Super stuff, really. Hmm. So, Agent Ransack, a pretty good tool. So that's Agent Ransack. In my opinion, a pretty good tool for a very specialist subject, which is looking for words inside a file. Very, very useful and in the basic version, completely free. If you like this video, then please like it, subscribe to the video so you can see more, tell more people about it. And remember, if there's something you'd be very interested in me doing a video on, then drop it in the comments down below and I'll see what I can do for you. So that's great. So thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye.